Um, so the purpose of this video is to create a easy way to update pricing for your products, whether it be new products, old products, some products, but the goal is not to do things manually, but to do things via flat file on Shopify. So what you want to do is go to your all products, export products, ex all products, and then hit CSV. You get a quick email that says your products have finished exporting. Looks like this. You click on download. And then what your product flat file will look like is just like this. So you'll get a lot of um, your uh, title standard products. You'll get a lot of fields that aren't really necessary for this task. So what you want to do is you want to start removing them. Um, so for example, you do that. Take that out. You need the vendor. Sign your product type. So you have to like filter out all these things here. And then also delete any blank rows that don't contain any information. So delete that. So essentially when you're all done, again, you're gonna have a file that looks something along this these lines right over here. Cool. So you have something that looks like this. It'll be cleaned up. And the most important part here, of course, is the handle. Um, just wanna emphasize that you wanna keep the handle. So when you do the upload, your Shopify store reads exactly what that product is, the option value, and also the variant SKU. So you wanna make sure that you wanna keep, keep the option values, you can keep your title, variant SKU, variant price, and your compared price is what you want to change. So your compared price will be your original price that you had and your variant price will be your um, your on sale price. For, for me, it's going to be 15% off. So what I've done is pre-formulated all the stuff here so you'll only see values. But if you look at the formula here, you get the old price times 0.15%, then you get the discount amount. And then you can either do it here where you get, you know, original price minus the discount amount. So you get 30, 60, or you can put it all together where you put the original price minus the formula. So you don't have to do double the work. Um, so there you have it. You have your new price and then you have your compare price. And what that'll do is create a strike through on your, um, on your product page and yeah, so what you want to do is once you fill that out, you want to hit import uh, and then you want to add the file and then make sure that it all looks good. And then once you upload the file, you get a success uh, message. And once you do that, the fun part begins and that's being able to see the discount on your front end. Let's see. There we go. See if it and that's it, that's what you'll get. You'll get your uh, before price and then your after price percentage and your USD. Obviously, it may differ on your website if you have different types of uh, you know, CSS or themes or templates, but um, this is pretty much what it'll look like. And what this allows you to do is you no longer have to tell your customer, hey, please plug in this 15% off coupon at checkout. Um, you can just be like, all right, well, it's already applied, so all you have to do is check out. And then on top of that, if you, if you want to get a little more crafty, you can you know add an additional 5% off coupon in the future, 10% off coupon. Um, but that's all I have. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them down below and make sure to subscribe, share the page. And if you have any additional topics you'd like me to cover, feel free to message me or leave it down below.